Hey guys, it is Chad. And it's Natasha. And we are out on a Sunday night. We decided that we wanted to walk around campus and show you guys some of the sights of Notre Dame uh, lit up at night. Uh, it's a cold December night. Not many people are out here. Not many, I say less than five on campus. Um, but we're excited to see some of the scenery. As you can see behind us right now, the Golden Dome is just absolutely stunning. Uh, but we're excited to show you some of the sights. So. You ready to go take a look around? Yeah, let's go. All right, let's go. All right, we are gonna start things off here at the Notre Dame bookstore. Uh, I know we've brought you here while there's a game going on, but on a December evening, on a Sunday, there's no one here. So I know they're closing soon. Let's go in and uh, check out their decorations. All right, we are in the atrium here at the bookstore. Welcome to Notre Dame. Beautiful tree. Like I said, it's really quiet in here. They're closing soon, so. I've got some nice decorations in here. I'll take a quick lap and show you some of the fun stuff. Here's some of the Christmas ornaments that they have here. Christmas ornaments and play like a champion today. Some beautiful Christmas cards. We were gonna purchase those to send out, but we love you all. But it's eight for thirty-five dollars, so maybe next year. Some cool other woody car ornaments that they have as well. Here are some cool images. These are all on a uh, some prints. Some giant canvases. I love that one. That looks incredible. That's kind of what we were hoping for tonight. I don't know if we're going to achieve that. I've seen it like this, but let's hope that we can pull off something even remotely close to this. I think it's a little darker though. All right, here we are at the the Morris Inn. That's a nice garland with lights out. Some wreaths up. Stay tuned. We will be bringing you something from the Morris Inn in the future. We're excited for that. All right, guys. So here we are at the Eck Hall, which is the law school here on campus at Notre Dame. And I absolutely love the architecture here all over campus, but particularly the law building here. Um, their law school is gorgeous. So some of you might know, I went to the University of Michigan and the law school there and a lot of the buildings are in a Gothic revival style. So this right here is also, if you look close at the windows and the stained glass around the buildings, it's all inspired by a Gothic revival style. So it's just absolutely beautiful. We'll go a little bit closer and kind of show you around, but I just love how the light and the clouds, how it's coming out, it's really making the building stand out. So here it is a little bit closer. You can see the archways of the doors and all of the windows and how everything is just beautifully lit up. Another thing too about campus too all around is it's just really beautifully manicured. And here's one of the Christmas trees here on campus. You can see up there by the window, up on the second floor. So I know I was trying to replicate that picture that we saw in the bookstore. I feel like I've, that we've done a pretty good job of that. The way that light at night hits that dome, especially when there's the sky like it is right now, and those clouds in the background. I mean, it looks amazing on camera. It's not quite, I mean, in person, it is glowing. But yeah, I feel like Everybody needs to come here and see this at least once. All right, we are here at the Basilica on campus. We just missed the, the bells playing for seven o'clock, but another just gorgeous building here on campus.
We've got some of the Christmas trees lit up on campus here. I guess they're not really Christmas trees, they're pine trees. Pine trees. With Christmas lights. With Christmas lights, which makes it a Christmas tree. <laughs> By default. I know the moon. Sorry about that bright light, but the moon. Just awesome out here. I swear this is a Christmas video, not a Halloween video. Another entrance in here to the Basilica. As you can see, and a lot of the shirts here, which is written above this door, is God, Country, Notre Dame. Right underneath the Golden Dome here. Looks magnificent against that sky. We live here, and I could still come here every day be in awe of this building. It's truly incredible. Down here by the grotto, they've put up a nativity scene. It's a very, very nice display. And here we are at the library here on campus, more commonly referred to and known as Touchdown, Touchdown Jesus. As you can see, it's all lit up 
and just really beautiful. Normally, you'll see right here that there is a pond. And if you stand right here, the reflection of Touchdown Jesus reflects down into the pond and it really makes a gorgeous image. So why is it called Touchdown Jesus, you ask? Well, right across, if we pan all the way across, you see the stadium here for the Irish and Notre Dame. Another thing too, just you can tell the beautiful scenery that there is here, we had our wedding photos done right here. And it was during the day, of course, but just beautiful lighting any time of day. Really kind of fun to see it at night though. As you can see down here, got the field lit up. They just let me in, run a few routes out there. We did a race here once where the finish is actually on the 50 yard line. You come running down this tunnel. I was so exhausted at the end, but by the time I got down there, I felt like I was running 100 miles an hour. I was so excited. Then here at the Newt Rockney Gate, statue of coach. Head coach from 18 to 30, 105 wins, 12 losses, five ties, three-time national champion. All right, guys, that was it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you've been here before or uh, you have any questions, feel free to comment below and let us know. But yeah, thanks guys for stopping by. And if you like what you saw, please consider subscribing. We'll see you next time. Bye.